Hey, um, I had a student ask me about a question in 8.2. Problem number 8. Let's see if we can talk through this. According to one source, 48% of plane crashes are due, at least in part, to pilot error. Suppose in a random sample of 100 separate airplane accidents, 62 of them were due, in error, due to error. Test the hypothesis that the proportion of accidents due to pilot error is not 48%. Use a significant level of 0.05. So remember that the null hypothesis always has the equal sign. In this case, we're testing whether it's not 48%. And we're using one sample, one sample of 100 airplanes. So I'm going to go to StatCrunch. So key words here are... Test the hypothesis that the proportion. So I'm going to have proportion stats. I'm going to have one sample with summary. I don't have all 100 airplane pieces of data. My number of successes in this case were 62 due to pilot error versus 100. My hypothesis test is testing whether the probability is 0.48 versus that it's not. And then I'm going to compute. And I'm given that my Z statistic is 2.802. And my p-value right here is 0 0.0051. Since 0 0.005 is smaller than 0 0.05, 0 0.05 is my alpha. If the p-value is smaller than alpha, I reject the null hypothesis. Therefore, if I reject that it's equal, there is evidence to conclude that it's not 48%. Oops. The percentage of plane crashes due to pilot error is significantly different 48% because the p-value is less than the significance level.